I feel like I should talk and voice the whole video. For the sake of being funny. <laughs> what do you say? Oh, what it. kind yeah. of voice? I was thinking of this voice. <laughs> I'm thinking of this voice. Ah, a fee voice, is it? Marvelous. Marvelous. You know what I imagine Fee saying? What? It's like, what the fox say? Oh, wait, what does the fox say? What does the fox say? What did say? the fee say? <laughs> <laughs> Let's see, how far into the video was that? Like, five seconds? What? All right. What? What? What are you trying to say? Uh... It, it looked like you had flowers growing out of your head just then. Yes. Are it's... you going to leave in the part where I said that I was going to do this entire video in a voice? Yeah, but you don't have to. I mean, unless, unless you to. want to. I want to. So bad. Yeah. All right. So I have a question. <laughs> yes. I thought about this at work, mm, because of situations. Yes. And also, Matt works. At, we both work at a factory, and uh, his job is to go around and uh, I work fix on the grinders. It grinds up material, basically. It recycles the, the fact material I, into other. Not material. important. Like, yeah, Wait. Whatever. The fact that you said grinder and grinding. Yes. It made me recall to this situation. Uh, All right. What? <laughs> Shut up. It don't matter. I need to know where just, this is going. Just. You're not talking know, in your please. voice. Hey, look. This guy's got a thing. You can't talk. They're talking right now. All right. What would you say is the most awkward thing that you can think of? Most awkward? Yeah. It's just like a um. situation that you're in or... What what is really really awkward for you? Or um, not even just for you. It might not even be just in your circumstances. Just just, just might not wow. be. Your... I have no idea. All right, so I'm gonna ask a question then. Okay. You gotta pick one. What's more awkward? When someone's cock just kind of gently rubs against your butt or the reverse when somebody else accidentally this is all accidents somebody else accidentally rubs oh, oh, hmm. oh wow like their butt against your crotch man men what's worse your dick and their butt with their butt against your dick I think them coming at you from behind. Yeah. It's really awkward. Um, both are, like... Have you ever had this happen? No. Say there's a tight space uh, and, like, multiple people are trying to get through it. I don't You've never think... just thought, like, that guy's junk that's just... It just rubbed against my butt. No. Hmm. I don't think I've ever had that hmm. happen to me. Unwillingly. Yes. <laughs> okay. Both. Okay. No, no. There was, there was that one time. What? There was that one time. All right. There was I'll that one time this. when that really non-homophobic thing happened. It was just, it was so not gay. Non-homophobic? Yes, non-homophobic. Oh, shut up. <laughs> it was so not gay is what I'm saying. <laughs> yeah, neither one of us were being homophobes at the time either. Like, we, we oh, weren't yeah, being homophobes about yeah. it. You know. Uh -uh. Okay. Yes. Oh, I see. Yeah, yeah. Do you do you see? Also, I had a uh, couple things that I wrote down because I had like these topics that just kind of came to me the other day. Ah, ah, ha, ha. Yes. And um, I forgot what they mean. I wrote them in like really short, really short sentences, and yeah, I, I don't know. You're like right like self oral penetration, I can't what? for the life of me remember what that was about. Like, ah, uh, it's got something to do with sucking your own dick. I th I feel I feel like that's it. Okay. But what could have been? That 
That sounds like that's where that's going. And then I have another one that says, sad moment, friend. <laughs> <laughs> well, <laughs> I don't remember. I don't know what this huh. means. And then another wow. one that I can't read because it's so tiny. It says emo, emo Torok. That's what <laughs> Torok is so emo. I don't know what that says. I had these interesting ideas about <laughs> sucking your own dick and they're gone. They're gone. Now we can't talk about them. Everybody's sad. Is, is that how your friend at work hurt his back? That would be interesting. <laughs> At work. Yeah, I just. Do Have that. you ever tried to suck your own dick? No. Hmm. Have do you, you think you would be able to? I mean, everybody's tried. Yes. I mean, at one point in their life, you have to try. I feel like that is mandatory as a man. Alright, give me another 10 minutes. Alright. Uh,. The trick is though, I think you gotta lay on your back and try to like, and try to like force, force your crotch towards your face. I think that's the trick. Now, when you say that, it sounds like you oh! have not yet tried. I remember what brought this up. I was watching oh, okay. that video. Oh my god! Wow. No. <laughs> <laughs> Do tell. <laughs> Uh, I want to know. We need to go to Canyon Path. There's two things I there. I need to know this about you, Ryan. I'll accept. No, you. it was it was a it was a video that we watched together, and uh, it had those dancing, um, girls and stuff, and wow. like they were like bent over so far that it just it just brought up, uh, the topic. Is it the one that's like? A bunch of non-related videos yes. all together. Okay, yeah. And there was like Asians dancing, and then there was like the some Russian the others. girls or something. This is Artisan Street. We're crafts okay. And There's a person in here that I need to talk to. Ah, <sighs> all I remember was that they were bent over. I think I just wanted to talk about it. I think that might have been it. And we did. We did talk about <laughs> it. We have succeeded in sad moments, task. friend. I don't know what that could mean. I think it's, I don't know. I have no idea. I think it's about you. You have so many sad moments. I do. So sad. I'm so sorry. Crawling in my skin. These wounds, they will not heal. Crawling in my skin. These wounds. Somebody in an earlier video, I don't even know if it was a serious, said that they really don't want to hear that singing anymore. Wow. Who, you or me? Me. I, it was specifically when I was singing uh, something else. I've patted you on the shoulder, and I'm announcing it so that people it, know. I mean, I appreciate the thought, but, I mean, keep it in your pants next time. <laughs> It becomes impressive when you realize that we are saying next to each other. Yeah. <laughs> Matt just whipped out his dong and just <laughs> patted me on the shoulder with it. So do you know what we're doing That'd right now? That'd be terrible. Like, I have no idea what we're doing. Uh, I'm just imagining the life struggle of... Buying one of the local gemstones on my income isn't... Not affordable. I think he's. Oh, he's about to ask somebody to marry him. Oh, Aww. so romantic. And and we gotta get him a precious stone. It's out of his budget. Mm. It's you gotta get the semi-precious. It's a little bit. You know what he needs? Worse. What? He needs an orbal ring. An orbal ring, or an <laughs> orbal um orbal auto blow. <laughs> I mean, Still on your mind. Well, yeah, we just we yeah. just seen that video. We, we just, just edited it. it. Yeah. yeah. See, this is a world where oh, <laughs> about to have a sad moment, friend moment. 
Oh, this is a world. <laughs> this is a world where yes. you don't need a girlfriend because you got things like auto blow. Why do you need the extra talking to go with auto blow? It's basically the same thing, except it. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like that was sexist. How dare you? I'm walking out now. Pat, 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 pat. pat. I mean. Slam. <laughs> I mean, they're not the same thing. There's a lot of talking that comes with a girl. Yes. And a lot less sexual favors. So obviously, the auto blow's better, but... You, you know what I'm saying. Yes. Yeah. It's just the crazy world that we live in nowadays that you can just make something like that. Yes. And sell it on the internet. Yes. For $149.99. If I bought I... one for you as a present, would you would you accept it? Yes. You could probably do other things with it. You could actually... like put a bunch of soap in there and like put your toothbrush in there and and no, maybe not your toothbrush. Silverware. You can put silverware in there, cleans it automatically. Perfect. Toothbrush would be a little weird. You don't clean your toothbrush with soap. Yes. Do you have nothing to add to that? <laughs> I I don't know. You kind of stole where I was going with it. I was going to say. I'm sure there are other things I could use with it. Or use it with. Use it for. I don't know. But that's enough hey. about myself. I hear you're seeking a dryad's tear. What? So. Could you sound with it? <laughs> <laughs> well, technically, like, if you imagine it as the penis, you're already sounding with it. No, I mean, like, put it in your penis? Auto sounding. Oh, ooh. I don't think sounding is meant to be, like, back and forth, back and forth thrusted. I think it's meant to just be put in there and then stay still. You don't know what some people are about. You don't know their lives. What, does this thing come with different speeds? This auto sounding device? Like, does it just, like, you know, you put it up your urethra and then it just starts, like, jamming in and out, like, either really <laughs> nice and slow or really fucking furious and hard. Yes. God. All right. That might break something. Ooh. Probably break many things. Pia. Who is this guy we were talking to? It's Baron Blue, Blue, Blue Blanc. Blue White? Blue Blanc. What creative naming sense? Yeah. Why not? Is that how you... Is that... Is like blue like that? French for blue? How would I know French? I'm not a fairy. French is the what? worst. French people are known to be fairies, you know, because they're pansies, homos, oh. even though we say some of the gayest stuff ever. <laughs> See? I mean, we're obviously more homoerotic, but I don't know fucking French. French is literally the worst. If you are French, I am sorry, but it is literally <laughs> the worst place and language. Apparently, um, there's this thing. Put a ring that on it. Japanese oh. people get when they go to France. They, there's such like a disappointing shock of seeing what, like France, or maybe Paris specifically is like, like just seeing it. They just like, it's traumatizing to them. Like it's not good enough. Like I don't, I don't understand. Like. It, I don't know. I guess that's it. It's just like because I know they a lot of times they they like it. Fuck. What do I gotta Can't do? Go exploring yet? We're only in chapter two. But all of my, all of <laughs> my quests tell me to go outside of town. 
So I'm trying to go outside of town. Shut the fuck so up, Emma. No one cares what you have to say. It's time to go already. Is it? Yeah. Wow. Thanks for joining us and watching. See you next time. Maybe with more talks of auto sounding and such things that we have discussed on Digimon. Or similar to things we have discussed on Digimon. <laughs>